All right, here we go. Circle hook swordfish bait. This is a swordfish um, bait really fished from a buoy. Can you fish it off a rod tip? Yes. But we're going to have another film shortly that you're going to watch talking about the effectiveness of a circle hook bait fished on a buoy away from the boat. Um, I'm going to show you how to rig one. We're going to go through step by step. Um, guys, circle hook baits, whether they're strips, whether they're actual bellies themselves, but it's the use of what we're actually doing with it, why we're doing it. But come on in, come over my shoulder. Let's talk about strip baits, swordfish baits, circle hook baits. They're already ordering them. Look at that. Sounding good? We're good? All right, let's roll. Let's go through the ingredients on rigging a circle hook bait for swordfish. Um, monofilament for your leader, 250 or 300. 300 is really the um, line of choice. Weight-wise, make sure you got a the correct crimp for it. Guys, we're rigging a circle hook. It's different than the standard J hook. And when you're looking at circle hooks, okay, there's a lot on the market out there. Look at the distance between the point and the actual shank of the hook. You want something that's relatively wide. Some of this other stuff, you're going to see where the actual hook comes in a lot. You need a little bit of bite there. You need that distance for sword fishing to be able for it to be effective. You don't have to be so conscious of this being sharp. Now the hook you're looking at is a 39948 NPBN. 39948 NPBN and that's a must add. Ultra point. Comes sharp out of the box. Always make sure you check it, but no need to put a file on that. So you see it's got a wide gap. Good hook of choice. Then 39960 must add silver hook. Beefier than this. Not bad. It's actually a little bigger if you wanted to get the same bite. We caught quite a few fish on that. The first one we caught out of Ocean City was on that hook, but this seems to be the hook of choice now. So make sure you got that hook. Um, obviously, we got our bait. We're going to rig a membrane today. This is a Bonita bait. Uh, membrane we call right there in the stomach cavity. Really, really good action bait. And we're going to end up talking about why, why we're choosing this bait for this uh, circle hook application. Make sure you got a good set of crimpers, good set of cutters. Obviously, we got our needle and our 50 pound floss right there. So this, these are the ingredients to make this rig. Let's get right into it. All right, here we go. First thing, a couple things to notice about the bait at the top of your